Hello everybody, welcome back to more Civ 6 on the Switch with me, Biffa. If you want to see more, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can get notified. And yeah, we're going to continue on with our playthrough of London. So we've been looking to try and get a, another city set up in this area over here at the top. We've got lots of cool resources. Stone, we've got rice, we've got more stone. Yeah, so that is going to really help us out. We've got rice over there. We've got fish. If we can get in here somewhere, that would be great. And we've got horses over there, which I'm not sure we'll be able to grab. If we went there, one, two, three, we'd get that. We'd get that. We'd get those. We'd get that. One, two, three. We wouldn't get that rice and that over here. Maybe this city will be further this way. We'll see. We'll see. Once we get to... Once we get to moving our set level, we'll, we'll see. So, producing nothing at the moment. We can do an encampment, which, as we know, is a... I want to say Eureka, but that's not the right word. Let's just back out of that and look at our menu over here with the city-states. Oh, is it the one that was destroyed? One of the city-states was destroyed. What's the quest here? Construction encampment. There we go. So, it would be these guys. Muscat. Yeah, do you remember the city-state up here was destroyed Carthage by China, I'm going to say? Huh, okay. All right, then, well, let's... Wait, come here. Let's get our cursor back over here and get building something in London. Yeah, let's go for an encampment. No suitable location to zone the district. What? Why the heck not? You're kidding. Uh, Civilopedia. What do we need? Um, great general, citizen yields, domestic requirements. Bronze working cannot be adjacent to the city centre. Ah, I bet that's it. Darn it. But we've got hills, we've got... So we can't place it... Uh, I'm assuming we can't... Um, if we put it... If we bought another tile, we might be able to then place it down. Like that one that these guys are on right now. And that would actually be quite good if we get any units coming from this way at any point. Yeah, let's buy a square. Uh, nope, wrong button. Oh yeah, I haven't played since yesterday. Getting used to the buttons again. There we go, London. Let us purchase a square. This one. I reckon if I buy that, I'll then be able to place it there. Please, districts and Yes, there we go. Encampment. Excellent. So that is it. That's the square it can go. Yeah, that'll be good. Want to build an encampment. Yes, and there's nothing there that would have been removed or anything like that. So, cool beans. Right, let's continue on. Russia declared war on Muscat. No. Hello. November and Azinga. Yes. Lovely to see you. Let's move that along. Honor to meet you. Thank you very much. Yes. We'll find out where your capital is. Where is your capital? Is this your capital? All the way over here. Looking like it is. Yes. A long way away. You've declared war on Muscat. Russia has. There's Russia. Oh, man. So we're going to get the bonus, then it's going to be destroyed. <laughs> like two turns later. Uh, these are linked, so that's fine. Let's actually change to the settler. Yeah, okay. Well, let's move out. That's as far as we can go. Remember we said last episode... Let's just quickly look through here. You've got the Hanging Gardens. Peter declared war on Muscat. Unmet city-state has been defeated. Oh, they're just wiping out the city-states. Good grief. Uh, let's just grab this again and look at our settler. I am going to sneeze... No, I'm fine. Uh, settler. So we can see the water availability guide. Yes, I sneezed. There we go. We get the settler. And the water availability guide, if we look up here. So we want to get plenty of housing by getting near enough to this river. So once we've sort of worked our way over there, hopefully, we'll be able to see a bit more what's going on with that. Okay, let's continue. We have one trade route going at the moment. I think that might actually be going to Muscat. So hopefully, it'll be finished... Uh, yeah, let's move you one more this way. I want it to start showing me um, 
I want it to start showing me good places to put the city, but it's, it isn't popping anything up like that, which is slightly annoying. I was thinking it would. So, I mean, I'm thinking that we're going to end up going on that square there. Or this one here. One, two, three, we'd get the rice. One, two, three, we'd get that. We'd get that. One, two, three, we'd get that as well. This square here, I think, is going to be the one. So we can grab up all these lovely extra bits. One, two, three, and we'd get that. Yeah, that's going to be the one. Okay, let's continue. This is when Russia comes in with uh, a settler and just steals my spot. <laughs> Okay, so let's switch over again to the Settler. And we're going to move there. No, here. That's where we go into. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Well, we're okay. We're defended all right. But as soon as we found a city, these guys, this scout doesn't wander away. He's then going to know exactly where we are. So I think this is going to be... We're going to try and... Yeah, get a major victory, attack him, get rid of him. Hopefully, no, still somebody left, but not too concerned about that. Uh, let us switch to the settler. Yeah, I think this is the spot. One, two, three, one, two, one, two, three. We're going to get everything from that spot. One, two, three, one, two, yeah. That's going to be it. We are going to get the settler. Can I... Open that up. Is it? Have we just moved? I think we've just moved, so it's not. We're going to unlink anyway, and there's nothing we can do with him at the moment, so that's fine. Right, these guys have healed up, and we're going to move them back. But I'm going to move you this way, so we can maybe sort of see what's going on up here. I think that would be a good idea. Yeah, let's see how that goes. Excellent. Right, we can do our city. Let us switch that. There we go, to our settler. And we're going to found it here. What are we going to get? Chester. Manchester. Excellent. Okay, let's move you that way. Excellent. And you are going to move... Well, we've got an archer in Manchester, an archer in London. Um... Is there any other... Just making sure there's no other barbarian camps that have popped up in this sort of area here. It doesn't look like it, does it? Maybe let's move you up with this guy. Because then if we spot any up here, we could do something about it, couldn't we? Um, you are going to... I don't think you've got one of those. No. Nope. So you are going to defend in here. Uh, what have we got here? London needs more housing. Yeah, we'll be working on that when we can. What are we going to produce? So we can do a monument or an encampment... I think a monument would be a good idea. Uh, let's actually have a look at Manchester. And... Oh, you can go up and down to switch the, on the units on the same square. Oh, that is really worth knowing as well. Excellent. Let's go back to Manchester. Whoops. There we go. Oh, that is handy. That makes things even quicker. So what are we getting? Uh, we've got... Yeah, let's switch you to there. Because we're going to get more production. I mean, a builder, we want to get out here as soon as we can. What are we building? Encampment? Yeah, okay. Well, let's just go with that. Good, good. Congo has conquered the original Zanzibari capital of Zanzibar. Each of us is carving a stone, Ooh. erecting a column, or cutting a piece of stained glass in the construction of something much bigger than ourselves. So we can get ancient walls, which are going to be handy. And the, and the encampment. They allow range strike from the city centre and encampment district. That is always good. Provides tourism later on. Pyramid. I don't think we're going to get that. Uh, battering ram and harvesting of stone, which is exactly what we want right now. So let us pick our next science option. Um, let's just have a quick look over here. Anything that we're needing... No, I think we've got everything we need for that. Build an iron mine. Did we not build a mine on this iron? I don't think we have. We seriously need to get some builders out, don't we? Sailing. So we could do fishing, which will be on that when it expands. Not yet. Okay, let us... Pottery's going to give us granary, which is going to make us grow quicker. Let's go for that first. 
City-state has been defeated. They do not like these city-states, do they? Good grief. Uh, okay, let's take this warrior. Aha, there we go. Qin Shi Huang. Gordon? What do you, you got against Gordon? Leave Gordon out of it. Uh, yes. Hospitality. Where is their city? Capital. Did they not show me? Uh, Muscat, Brunei. No, they didn't, did they? Okay, well, we'll maybe do that next time. Carthage. Oh, well, they got Carthage, haven't they? So that's how we've managed to spot them. Yep, yeah, okay. We've met. Yes, thank you very much. Um, I'm going to move you around this way, I think. Yeah, let's get you up to there. Good. Next turn, sip of tea. Suppose they paint a pollen. Well, that's what you think. Goodbye. So, which one are you talking about? There must be what? Oh, boosted workforce. There we go. Excellent. First district has boosted that. Encampments and military tradition. Perfect. I just want to have a look at how bad we are doing on the world rankings. So, last in science, last in culture, domination victory is getting better. That is what I want to know. So, Pericles, let's go back down to here again, is 168 military strength. I'm worried about him. Uh, 100 for Peter, 95 for us. So, if I can get... I think we're within the range of them not being that bothered about attacking us. Oh, we've earned a reward in Muscat. Excellent. And we've boosted that. It's boosted military training. Cool. So, we've got two envoys in Muscat. If we get a third... So that's only influenced by us, yes. So I don't know whether that's going to upset Pericles or not. So London. Oh, we've got options for wonders. Can't do that. Projects. Can't do that. Oh, we can. We don't want to do that. Uh, we want builders. Yes. I mean, we could buy a builder and then build a builder. But they only take three turns. Shall we? 215 plus 17. Yeah, let's keep the gold. We'll do that. Let's send you up here. Okay, very good. Uh, yep, you're auto-moving, so that's fine. Aha. You, I have transgressed Peter's agenda ideologue. Goodbye. Okay, well, fine. <laughs> Whatever. Well, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that information, but there we go. Let's move you up here. And, yep, next turn. Do you wonder whether we could just buy this monument, actually? We've been sort of... Mm, let's quick switch to Manchester. Oh, I like that. I like that. Uh, how would I buy the monuments? Districts and buildings. Monuments. 240 gold. Yes. I'm going to buy... Oh, I'm going to buy ancient walls. Oh, I can't. 20 turns, 240 gold. Yeah. I want to get that city going. So we're going to help it out. At Manchester, you are going to make a builder. Yeah, we're just going to make a builder. You are going to just head on over here and have a look around. You are going to head up to there. And next... Oh, how's our science and stuff doing? Uh, did we already boost this one? Grow your civilization to at least six. Ah, oh, darn it, we didn't. Four, five. I thought Clay must feel happy in the good potter's hand. So we've got the granary and harvesting wheat and rice. Yeah, early empire. I was going to stop it, wasn't I, and switch. But we've got one turn left. We may as well just get it, to be honest. So let's come out of that. Pottery we've got. Fantastic. Found a natural wonder so we could get that. Irrigation, yes. That's been boosted. So let's grab irrigation. Right, London. You have a builder. Perfect. How about... A spearman. Anti-cavalry. We want to just keep those units going. Let's run you over here. That's the coast. Okay. Uh, builder. Yeah, we want to get that built on there for sure. Get a mine on the iron. Uh, let's move you over here a bit. Okay, good. Expanding, expanding. We've got the money coming in. Trade delegation should be arriving soon with Fufu. Enjoy the meal. 
No idea. Do you know what foo foo is? If you know what foo foo is, let me know in the comments. Uh, Peter's made it was luxuries like air conditioning that brought down the Roman Empire. With air conditioning, their windows were shut. They couldn't hear the barbarians coming. Okay, so reduce the cost of purchasing tile by 20% land surveyors. Colonization. There we go. That is the one I wanted before, wasn't it? And open borders and grant it to others. Okay, let's just have a quick look. Moscow has made peace. Okay. <clears throat> so, what are we doing at the minute? Against barbarians, we don't have any. So, I'm thinking of changing that one. Um, like cavalry. Yeah, double experience for recon. I mean, we could put in a gog. Or maneuver. Oh, we can't build cavalry units yet. So, we could put in a gog. And pump out a couple of units before our next change. And hope we don't meet any barbarians. If we did, I think we'd be okay. And then the plus one production urban planning that we've got over here in all of our cities. We could change to... Reduce the cost of purchasing a tile. 30% towards builders. Pop out some builders. Yeah, let's do that. And this one. And we're going to use the next switch between... Between now and switching our government next to make more units and builders. Yes, we're going to do that. We're going to get some growth. We're going to move you up here and have a look. And we're going to move you over here and have a look. Ooh, some more iron is untouched. And maybe a nice little... That looks like the sea comes around there. So we can sort of keep this spot to ourselves. Right, state workforce. Yeah, we're going to go for that as that has already been boosted. Excellent. Let us move on. And there's some iron there as well. We can grab some more of that. Hopefully these guys don't get any closer. We shall see. Right. Yep. Let's build. Build that. Thank you kindly. That will boost the wheel. Thank you very much. That will boost iron working. Thank you very much. Uh, let's move you over there. What have we got here? Tech boosted wheel. Tech boosted iron working. Fantastic. Uh, yeah. We're going to move you over. Um, yep, next turn. China is worshipping a pantheon. So they've started their pantheon. Still haven't done that ourselves yet. Let's move you up here. Thank you kindly. We'll move you over there. All right. As long as we keep that. I mean, I might just put my archer over. Oh, no, hang on. Let's get this builder going first. Farm, mine. Yeah, let's get another mine going. Actually, we can get the farm first, can we? Let's get the, let's get that. Yeah, up here. If we can keep our archer over here and keep this land open, we won't get any barbarians spawning there. And then maybe the same over here with our warrior, something like that. We shall see. We shall see. Oh, was I going to quit switch out of? The man who has grit enough to no, bring about the afforestation or the irrigation of a country is not less worthy of honour than its conqueror. Thank you. So, Hanging Gardens, Plantation, which is good, and Clearing a Marsh, Harvesting of Bananas. Excellent. So, now we have a Spearman in here, um, which I think, to be honest, you could just... Oh, let's close that there. You could just fortify right there in that encampment. I think that'll be fine. Um, I'm going to move you back over here, shall I? No, let's move our warrior to sort of there. And then our archer, we're going to move this way. And just see if we can keep things open. Right, irrigation we've got. Wheel, what's that going to give us? Watermill and heavy chariot. Writing will give us library and campus. Yes. Seriously need to do that. I mean, where we've got some mountains down here, which are going to be... We're going to end up getting rid of that little forestry tile. Let me show you down here. That little forestry tile there is probably going to go, unfortunately. You don't have many mountains down here. What about up here? No mountains around this one at all. Hmm, okay. Right, London. London. Let's see. Districts and buildings. Granary, so we'll grow quicker. Ancient walls, barracks. Granary, I think, would be a good idea. Uh, we look at the Civilopedia for Granary. 
I don't think it actually says, but I think every time the city grows, we only lose half of our amount of food. So we'll grow quicker. So we'll go for that. Uh, you're going to build that farm for us. Thank you very much. Build the farm. I think that's it. So let me have a quick look. I always like to keep an eye on my world ranking. So science we're low. Domination, that's the one I wanted to check. So 168. Kinshi Huang is 159, 136, 95 years. So they're like, they are just whacking out units. Good grief. Novgorod. Where's that been built? Down here. There we go. Novgorod. So builder, you've done that. Let's get over here and do this mine. What are you building up there? You're doing a builder up there. Yeah, let's move you over there. Get that done. Uh, more housing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're trying. If I get you on this desert hill, I think that will keep... I mean, that looks to me like a reasonable spot. We've got stone. That's actually going to be... Too, oh, that iron is just out of reach of this city here. I mean, a coastal desert city with Petra, maybe. I don't know. Something like that. Oh, we've got crabs up there as well. One, two. No, they're just too far away. Oh, we've got crabs. Not something you really want to be. A strong economy worried about. Right, a strong, well-educated workforce. Uh, Fifteen percent production toward ancient and classical wonders. One gold per turn. Maintenance reduction of units. Okay. I don't think we're going to be changing our policies. And oh, do you know what? I said I was going to pump out units, and I've started building a. A granary here, didn't I? I did, didn't I? And I've, I've, I've changed it. Um, London, London. Okay, let's get that again. Let's switch. Let's move over. Two turns left. All right, two turns. We'll keep those a bit longer and get some more units after that. Right, here we go. Political philosophy gives us all the government options. There we go. Which is really where we want to be. So we're going to do that one. You are going to... Stay on alert. There. Good. You are going to come over here. Maybe stay on alert over there. If any ships sort of come wandering by, we'll, we'll see them. There we go. Got a mine on there. And that's the builder done. Excellent. Another quick sip of tea. Ah, oh, yeah. Come on now. Goodbye. Alright, can we maybe... Do something to cheer you up? I bet you won't accept anything from me. Yeah, you're not going to, are you? Do you know what? Forget it. Forget it if you're going to be like that. If you're going to be like that, forget it. I mean, you're not that close. You're. Oh, that's Peter, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, you're miles away over here. So hopefully, is easy. not too much of an issue. All you have to do is cross out the wrong words. Library and campus. We seriously need to get a campus writing going. Writing is easy. Yes, thank you. you. You explain how easy writing is. Right, ironworking is now boosted. So then we can get swordsmen. And a couple of those will suddenly... Yeah, you're going to sleep there. We'll suddenly boost our score something chronic. Right, units. Uh, archer, spearman. Let's go for another archer. Yep. We can maybe spread those out a bit. Just want to make sure that we don't look like we're easy pickings. That's, that's the thing I'm worried about most. I mean, a third city would be nice. Which we could put sort of in here. There's like three mountains around there. Which would be good for science. We'd have sheep. We'd have horses. So what's that? That's the archer. Let us... I'm going to bring him up to... In between the mountains there. Yeah, there you go. I mean, it's going to be near to Carthage. Which is Kinshi. Closer to Pericles. But that, to me, looks like a reasonable spot... 
Someone else is going to grab that one up there, I'm sure. I'm thinking we need to like start boosting our science. And they're the nearest mountains to what we've got. Shall we build a, a settler super quick? 440 gold. I'm going to buy it. We're not using our money for anything else. So, And then we're going to go for another unit. We're going to go for a builder to go with you. Yes. There we go. That's what we're going to do. And then hopefully we get there before anybody else does. And there's a nice river moving through there as well. Right, can you move up to there? Two turns. Well, we'll get you there soon. Uh, you can actually go back and then you can link together with them. Excellent. So if we have a look at our settler. Yeah, some housing stuff going on there. If we got in, let's have a look. Now let's come out of that. If we got in here, so say there, one, two, three, we'd be overlapping a bit. One, two, three. So, I mean, when this one grows, actually, London, he's going to get this square here, this square here, that one there. So there's a couple of slots that we could put in campuses and things like that. But, yeah, if we went for this one, I mean, Carthage is going to complain. One, two, three. We could buy that rice. We'll get that. We'll get that. Sheep, horses, sheep. I think that's where we're going to go. We're going to be right by the river. We've got the mountains surrounding us. Nice and defensible with the mountains there. You know, we could funnel the units in a bit. Pericles has declared war. Oh, on China. There we go. We've got the pop-up anyway. Okay, so let's switch to the settler. Let's move you in. Can you go another one? We're going to go that way anyway. So let's do that. Yeah, I think that's... It's a toss-up between that and more iron and the city up there. I think this one's got more, more bonuses, more things going for it. So, yeah. That is why we're going that way. Next turn. Greece has targeted protection war by Hattusa. Wow. There's wars going on all over the place. Well, they start knocking each other down. I'm quite happy about that. Uh, right. Politics is the art of the possible, the attainable, the art of the next best. Okay, so what have we got here? Autocracy. Uh, oligarchy. So we get internment bonus. Capital receives plus one boost at all yields. And also, bonus to wonder production. Not too worried about that. Uh, influence points. We get an envoy at 100 points. Okay. Oligarchy. All land units gain plus four combat strength. Ooh. Melee units, yeah. Uh, bonus combat strength for units. 20% plus for every... 20% plus 1% for every five turns on standard speed. And then influence generation. Three, yeah, okay, same. Classical Republic, all cities with a district plus one amenity. That could be handy. Great people points. Nice. Then we get extra cards. So charismatic leader, plus two influence points per turn towards city-state envoys. We're running out of city-states, aren't we? That's the only problem. Um, and then the first one you send counts as two. I think that backdates. It does on Rise and Fall. I don't know whether it backdates on, you know, Vanilla Civ 6. And then two envoys in Build War. Okay. So, that's going to give us some extra governments to unlock. Oh, send a trade route Muscat wants us to do. And trigger an inspiration for recorded history. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of that one and that one. And all roads upgraded. Extra movement points. Nice. So, we're going to choose about which one of these we're going to go for in the next episode. Hit the big B with a T stain to subscribe. Give me your suggestions in the comments below. And I will see you then. Thanks for watching. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.